In this lecture, we want to prove that for a non-homogeneous system of equations given as Ax equals to B, where A is n by n matrix, x is n by 1 vector and B is also n by 1 vector. If the system Ax equals to B has two non-zero solutions, say vector u and vector v such that vector u is not equals to vector v then the system ax equals to b has infinite solutions in other words a non-homogeneous system of equation ax equals to b can either have a unique solution or infinite number of solutions any intermediate situation of having more than one finite solution is not possible so if we know or we can show that ax equals to b has more than one solution then it will have to have infinite number of solutions so let's prove this statement because u and v are solutions of ax equals to b they should satisfy this equation so that implies a u equals to b let's call this 2 and a v equals to b let's call this 3 now if i do 2 minus 3 this will give me a u minus a v equals to 0 here this 0 represents a 0 vector which is of size n by 1 i can write this as a u minus v equals to 0 and because u is not equals to v u minus v will not be 0 so here i can say that u minus v is a non trivial solution of homogeneous system ax equals to 0 here note that by non trivial we mean not 0 and this ax equals to 0 is corresponding homogeneous system to our given non homogeneous system ax equals to b so here our homogeneous system ax equals to 0 has a non trivial solution u minus v and that is only possible if determinant of a is 0 so this implies determinant of a equals to 0 now next part of proof requires use of an identity that is adjoint of a into a equals to a into adjoint of a equals to determinant of a into i where i is identity matrix of appropriate size and in this case that is n by n here adjoint of a is transpose of cofactor matrix and this is the identity that gives us a inverse equals to adjoint of a divided by determinant of a when determinant of a is not equals to 0 but this identity is true in all situations whether determinant of a is 0 or non zero so next i will pre multiply my given non homogeneous equation ax equal to b by adjoint of a and adjoint of a into a will be equals to determinant of a into i and this implies here i into x will be just simply x so i have determinant of a into x equals to adjoint of a into b here we have shown the determinant of a is 0 so this is 0 into a non zero vector x so left hand side will always be 0 and that is a zero vector of size n by 1 and that implies adjoint of a into b should also be 0 so for our given non homogeneous equation ax equals to b we have shown that determinant a is 0 and adjoint of a into b is also equals to 0 so that implies ax equals to b has infinite solutions and if you want to know in more detail that for a non homogeneous system ax 
equals to b when determinant of a is 0 and adjoint of a into b is 0 then y it has infinite solutions then you can watch my video on how many solutions does system ax equals to b have in general 